City Council member, one of the biggest concerns that I have is the speed that this is moving at um, and the inability for us to really figure out uh, how this would impact uh, families in our city. Um, normally in the, in the past what we've been able to do is take a look at some of these bills, um, pass resolutions and actually get involved in, in the process. Um, we have council meetings tonight. I uh, had one last night and this, this bill has been moving so fast that we haven't had a chance actually um, to look at how living wage would impact our city. I think the bottom line is when you think about living wage and you think about what compensation people get for their hard work in our city, what it really comes down to is uh, whether families can afford groceries, whether they can afford gas, whether they can afford daycare. It's all the things that make our, our community a better place. Um, if the state legislature is going to take um, this swift action to take away our local rights and our local ability to set, uh, potentially set a living wage, um, that impacts our families here and that impacts um, how, you know, the quality of life in our city. So I think the, the prudent thing to do at this point would be to slow this down to give us a chance to look at how it would impact our city um, and to, you know, to remember the, that we here in Eau Claire know what's best for Eau Claire.